Light Blood Analysis While it is never to be used to diagnose any disease, it can reveal important root imbalances and deficiencies that can contribute to how we feel. If left unchecked, these imbalances can lead to disease, but the reverse is also true. If our bodies are in balance, eliminate well, and we are getting the proper nutrition, our body has an amazing ability to heal itself. The terrain matters. If you have ever had a fish tank, you understand the delicate balance that must be maintained in order to support and sustain the life of your fish. Fish can only survive in a balanced pH environment, and if it becomes too acidic or alkaline, your fish will develop a myriad of different diseases and die. These diseases are usually parasitic, fungi, or worm infestations. But how did those get into the fish tank? Their environment is host to many organisms. When the terrain becomes out of balance, these organisms grow, shifting the balance even further. This puts stress on living systems, making it even more difficult to restore the delicate balance. What caused the imbalance? Lack of clean water, proper filtration, a flux in temperature, waste, or undigested food building up in the water, imbalanced diet, overeating, and stress, are just some of the things that can contribute. Remember, I am still talking about fish tanks. But I am sure that you noticed that medical professionals have been stressing many of these same things regarding maintaining our own health. The human terrain. All these same things cause overacidity and toxicity in our internal fish tank, known as our bloodstream. By looking at a drop of blood under a microscope, we can see the condition of our internal state. The shapes, organization, and the motility of our blood cells tell us much about the why we may have certain symptoms or conditions. It also gives us great clues on how to reduce or eliminate them. If that blood is acidic or loaded with toxins, the liver can no longer filter. Then cells bunch together, get damaged and can't do their job. This results in low oxygen levels, poor uptake of nutrients, and affect proper function, as well as the literal makeup of those organs and of course, how we feel. Healthy versus unhealthy Here are just a few of the ways that our blood can look and the imbalances associated with different patterns. White dot on red blood cell is yeast or candida. Dents and dings around edges of red blood cell are free radical damage. Clusters of bubbles in plasma are yeast or candida overgrowth. Stacks of red blood cells are dehydration or acidic terrain and digestive imbalance. Pointed cells are protein digestive issue, toxic terrain. Cracked glass appearance is liver stress. Dark center is toxic bowel. Pinpoint holes in center is adrenal stress or fatigue. White blotches is lymphatic congestion or toxicity and systemic degeneration. The human condition. As energy levels decline, we gain weight. We don't sleep well. Our skin breaks out. We get headaches. We are stiff in the morning. Our hands or feet swell. We bloat, or we may not be able to keep from getting sick whenever you are exposed to others who are ill around you. Without cleaning up the toxic environment, any treatment of those symptoms, conventional treatment, is only superficial. Even those conditions labeled as hereditary are often treatable with proper and supervised detoxification and nutritional protocols. The most exciting part? You can see the changes happening inside, sometimes before you can see or feel them elsewhere, and immediately know you're on the right path. Since red blood cells regenerate every 120 days, we will follow one cycle and reevaluate two to three times or until we see the desired changes in the blood. After that, an annual retest is recommended. Curious about what your blood has got to say? Schedule your analysis today.